Hey everybody, today is day 21 of my video challenge and today I just want to talk to you about a topic that kind of comes up in my house and uh, my boyfriend is a business owner. He's been in business with his dad for decades and decades and decades um, and he's getting ready to open his own business in less than a month, which is super, super exciting, but it's also super, super stressful for him. Uh, so we always have this argument, like, and I, it's not even really an argument, we always have this discussion, and we kind of banter back and forth about it, but I have worked for someone else for my entire career, like, over 12 years, and I, like, you know, just recently, when I found my dream segue into the online marketing world, I, like, suddenly got this huge realization that I hate working for someone else. And I think I was just really um, complacent with it and had this very salary mentality of, you know, no matter what I do, big or small, I get the same paycheck, which is, you know, what let's call a salary mentality. So we always have this discussion about, is it better to own your own business or to be an employee and work for someone else? See, I've always been an employee up until recently. And to me, that's always just, it's stuck. I mean, I've had really, I've had nice bosses, don't get me wrong. I'm not like bashing any certain personality or anything. But working for someone else when you have a family and you have commitment, I just don't think there's a boss out there. Uh, or if there are, they, they are a rare breed that truly understands your commitment to your family and your need to take time off or your need to, you know, not have to bring your kids to work and they're sick or not having to feel guilty about calling off. And so I've done that like my whole life and I've been a single parent, which, you know, makes it that much harder. You know, I don't have a plan B for my kids when they're sick. I am plan A, B, C, all the way through D, you know. So we keep getting this discussion about is it better to own your own business and, it, and we came to the realization that it really kind of depends on what type of business you own. I mean, if you do own a very labored, uh, brick and mortar, built from the ground up type of business, then uh, I can kind of see both points of that. However, I'm still leaning towards the side of, I think it's better to be a business owner. Uh, because you can take vacations and you know, you can't, and I'm not saying that, you know, you just stick your feet up on a desk and you never have to be there. Trust me, you know, from watching my boyfriend run his business, that is so not how it goes. He actually has two um, weeks of several vacation in a year, like they're the same week every single year. And this year was so crazy that he didn't even take that vacation. And I don't, and I know for a fact that he doesn't even remember the last time that that happened. So, no, it's not easy. However... If you own your own business, I still, I'm still leaning towards the fact that there's just a freedom within that. There's a freedom of being able to, you know, to not have to answer to anyone. When your child brings home that field trip slip that says, can you go? Yes, you can go. No, you don't have to check in with anybody. Um, there, there's just so much freedom to it. And I've gotten a taste of that freedom lately. And it made me a little more frustrated in that employee world, uh, but it's also made me a better person. It's made me realize, you know, what my worth is to an employer and what my value is there uh, and whether or not I'm under, over estimated or, you know, estimated just exactly as to what someone thinks I'm worth per hour. Um, you got to give it your all no matter what you're doing. If you're not liking what you're doing, then you got to get out of there. So this video is getting a little long, <laughs> but this is day 21 of my video challenge. And if you are curious about what type of business I'm in and why I'm so adamant about this freedom lifestyle and being able to not have to report to a boss and not feel guilty about, you know, taking days off if my kid is sick. And, you know, if you're interested in something like that, then Click the link below and I will give you some more information about this awesome, awesome community that I have become a part of. I, I can't imagine my life without it. I just, you know, I could sit here and talk for another four minutes and 50 seconds, but I won't. 
So click the link below, get connected, and find out how you can actually build a business while have a, while you have a life. <laughs> Thanks, guys.